Hey, what's up, you guys? So, um, welcome to the Lost Planet films, and uh, we're gonna talk about this new place called uh, Glenel Dam. It's in uh, Italy, in a place called Villamore di Scalve. I don't know what that means. <laughs> it's Italian. Uh, so it basically says the sinister ruins of one of the worst dam failures of the. 20th century lies in this astonishing alpine setting. Um, as you can see, there's lots of pictures. And uh, according to atlasobscura.com, it's uh, in a growing modern nation craving for energy as Italy was at the beginning of the 20th century. Hydroelectric power was a synonym of progress, representing a victory of humankind over nature. Yet in the mountains of Bergamo province in Lombardy. That attempted feat would take a tragic turn. Tragic turn. Uh, construction of the hydroelectric dam to exploit the river Gleno and the Valley de Scalve, Scalve Valley began in 1916, but the project was immediately cursed by poor materials and poor workmanship. On top of that, Due to funding problems, the plan changed from the I original idea of a gravity dam to multiple arc dam while the work was still in progress, resulting in a mixed type dam. Just after its completion, heavy rains filled the reservoir and several leaks caused concern among the inhabitants of the valley below. Sure enough, on December 1st, 1923, at 7.15 in the morning, the tragedy happened. The central section collapsed, causing a mass of 4.5 million cubic meters of water to pour into the villages of the Scout Valley. The official death toll counted 356 lives lost as the result of the flood, as well as massive damage to roads, bridges, and buildings. What happened? What remains of the dam is a 160 foot high concrete barrage with a huge chilling laceration in its central section. The sinister ruins are a stark and surreal contrast with the stunning alpine surroundings. Know before you go, the dam is reachable following two easy treks, one from Nona and the other from Pianaz. Uh, Pianiza, I don't know if I pronounced that right. Um, both fractions of Villaminor Discalve. Uh, the one from Nona follows a moderate path, while the one from Pianiza, which goes along the path N411, I don't know what that means, but is steeper but way more scenic, following the old road carved into the rock cliff. And that's basically all I could find about this place. So if you're ever in Italy, stop by this place. If you could afford it, if you could find it. Uh, I personally have never seen an abandoned dam. That would be super cool to see. So yeah, definitely check it out. If you're ever there, take some pictures and, uh, I guess, uh, post them somewhere and send me the link or make a video out of it and comment below about it. Uh, yeah, do that. And, uh, also don't forget to subscribe and like the video. And yeah, that's about it. Thanks for watching. Peace out. Mm -hmm.